What's going on? The bull shot at the bull shot fadeaway cut. What I'm about to do right now is I'm about to show y'all how to blend the hair ring when you got a guy that's losing his hair or balding or whatever you want to call it, thinning. So first thing we're going to do, first thing you always want to do is you always see how it started, but you want to uh, take your liners and line them up. See, I already started lining them up, so you want to take your liners and line them up to do your little outline on what you need to do. Next thing you need to do is take your clippers and cut it down to a length that matches this length. You want to kind of get it to match, so you want to kind of start right, right here on it. Get it to match. You're looking for a smooth transition on it. Once you get it like that, you want to make sure it's smooth, evened up. You want to kind of touch on that spot first. That's the best thing to do. If you touch on that spot first, it gives you a good guideline on what you need to do. Good guideline. Sometimes you got to stand the clippers up. Usually you lay the clippers down like that on the head. But right now we're going to do, we're going to stand it up like this. Go over it like this. Go over it like this. Just like that. You gotta stand it up. Alright, man. Over the light, just like that. Just to give it a smooth transition. As you can see, it's starting to blend in fairly nicely. Just like that. Smooth. And after that, once you get that right, then you can just come on in and just cut the hair the way it needs to be cut. And now you can just go ahead and go in on the desired length. As you see for his hair, I kind of got it closed halfway. I only have it closed halfway. So, just come in. Make sure that you be mindful of the spots where it's thinning that because you don't want to cut too far at this length because then you'll cut too much hair off. You know? So you come around, take off the hair, same length. And when you get to the top part, if you notice that it's a little thin up here, what you want to do is you want to cut around the thinning part. Cut around. And cut into it. Right? Then come back, stand in the clippers up. And do the same thing you did on the top part. Just to thin it out. Just like that. So it's fairly easy. You be careful that you don't do it too much because you don't want to take too much hair off. You want to blend it. This is blending, not fading. Fading and blending is not the same. So I'm not fading. You don't want to see a transition. You just want to want it all to kind of look the same. Just like that. 